Good afternoon. It is Sunday, April 24th, and you're looking at a live view of Dragon Endeavour spacecraft as we await its departure from the International Space Station on its way back to planet Earth. We expect Endeavour to push away from the space station at 5.55 p.m. Pacific time with Axiom astronauts Michael Lopez Alegria, Larry Connor. Uh, Dragon's going to use its Draco thrusters uh, to thrust away from the station in a series of carefully choreographed maneuvers or four departure burns to increase the distance between the spacecraft and the space station. Dragon will also execute a phasing burn to lower its orbit and line the spacecraft up with its landing zone. Loaded about 200 pounds of science and hardware on board. Uh, they got in their, in their uh, launch and entry suits. All hooks open and nominal. And right on time, physical separation confirmed. 8.10 p.m. Central Time, 6.10 p.m. Pacific. Dragon separation confirmed. Burns are nominal so far. SpaceX Dragon Endeavor and the first private astronaut crew, AX-1, separating from the International Space Station, concluding their 15 days aboard the orbiting laboratory. Depart zero burn complete and nominal. Flight controllers are tracking a good departure of SpaceX Dragon Endeavor and the AX-1 crew inside. Everything's looking good. They're now at this time, I am able to confirm that we have had claw separation and trunk separation. Uh, once again, we are in an expected loss of signal or LOS period. Uh, essentially, we're not able to receive any communication from the crew at this point in time. But as I said before, expected. The crew knows that. The teams on the ground right. here know that. Dragon SpaceX comm check. The lot is clear, Sarah. Crew's doing fine. Copy that. Great to hear from you of events, right? We deploy the drugs very quickly after. There we go. We've seen the drugs deploy now. Live view from onboard Dragon Endeavor of those drogue parachutes. Capsule's going about 350 miles per hour. Nominal ascent rate for two healthy drogues. You know, and having that single voice at the core, talking to crew, coming, at, letting crew know that they're going into a planned LOS, mm -hmm. and then coming back. All right, there's the four mains to plan. All right, so we visual. We have visual on four mains. So there we heard that confirmation of four mains deploying. And the center is nominal. Gorgeous shot through reporting that they're only a thousand meters right. uh, from splashdown. Right. Um, you know, we had to learn how to make Dragon waterproof, <laughs> but once you do, that's it. It's a rinse, review, reuse type process. Right. And right now, I think those parachutes slowed the vehicle down to about is that about 50, 15 miles, miles per, per hour. hour. Yep. As you can tell by the cheers behind us, we can confirm that the Dragon capsule with the AX-1 crew has, has splashed down. Dragon Endeavor has returned home with the Axiom-1 crew. Dragon SpaceX, we see splashdown and mains cut. On behalf of the entire SpaceX team, welcome back to planet Earth. <laughs> the Axiom-1 mission marks the beginning of a new paradigm for human spaceflight. We hope you we hope you enjoyed the extra few days in space and thanks for choosing to fly with SpaceX. There's that crew member you mentioned who climbs aboard 
Dragon to ensure that the rigging gets uh, established properly to pull the capsule back in. Dragon SpaceX, brace for Boom. capsule lift. <laughs> and accurately, making sure that the, yep, your hoist system is ready to hoist, right? Which we can see there now. All right, so the Axiom 1 crew is now out of the water, making their way onto the deck of our recovery vessel, Megan. We can see some water splashing out there from the part of the capsule where the parachutes were um, stowed in. So that. All right, looks like that side hatch is open. Excellent. We've got a camera making way to see our crew for the first time there. All waving, all in good spirits. See a bunch of thumbs up. Welcome home, AX1.